So the project today is to try to remove this big boulder from the lawn. You only see the top of it. When I do try to hit it with a crowbar, it does not move at all. So it's gonna be a very big rock, a boulder or bedrock. So I want to remove it. I'm gonna try to drill it with this one and use some wedges and feathers and just some basic hand tools. When you do use these wedges and feathers, it's very important that the drill you use is the right diameter for the wedges. This is a 34 millimeter. And the check system on this DeWalt is STS Max. So here we can see the rock a little bit better. I have decided to drill two holes, one at the angel in here and another here. Okay, so the holes are drilled. I'm getting ready to insert the wedges. But it's very important to put on some grease to reduce the friction. I put it on all the surfaces to reduce the friction. When you install the feathers, it's very important to think about the direction the forces are going. Now I want the rock to crack at this point. So I have to put it 
just like this. And I just started the small hammer. Add just a little bit more grease on this one. Now it's ready to start with a sl sledgehammer and I do highly recommend eye protection. I just usually start with a small hammer. I need a sledgehammer, a big one. Usually you start to hear when the rock is cracking. You can see a big knife crack. Ah, that's a good size. Now it's just to use some type of a crowbar or a pry bar and start lift up. I think I will use the big one. It's a good idea to use smaller pieces, a wedge in the Crack to lift up the big stone. Okay, so I just decided to drill another hole. I split this one in half as well to get some smaller parts for easier removing. I don't have an excavator here now.
rocks are completely out. And now the highest point is about 10 to 15 centimeters below the surface of the lawn. So that's okay. I'm very happy with the result. So the job that is now finished, again I'm very happy with the result, the only thing it remind, reminds is just to fill in some dirt and put on some grass seeds, but that won't be before the spring. It's now mid of October, we're in Norway, in the mountains, and winter is just about to come.